working super good. Ultra high performance pro board and it's exactly what my style needs. Feels super natural in the barrel. Great off the bottom and top turns. How does that feel compared to boards in the past you've been using? Um, really, I mean, I've only felt an improvement with the board, as we should every year when we release new boards. I think if a bo any board passes the test of surfing a week at Teopo, it's it passes the strength test for yeah. sure. Putting a lot of hours on them and throwing them over the reef and the lagoon and getting dragged across the, the lagoon and um, it really is holding up good even with direct contact with the, the rocks or the reef. Um, I'm super surprised with how strong it's holding up for sure. The flax for instance, we have a UD flax rail. So it's a really cool natural material that's get it from Europe um, and it's like 90% less energy used to produce this than glass fiber. So that's amazing. And it's way better for the guys working on it too yeah, in the yeah. shop. Yeah. Sure, you don't have those carbon itches. Yeah, it's easier. And the stiffness of this flax has performed better than some carbon fibers, which is insane. uses the, the engrain balsa. So the, the engrain balsa is from Ecuador and this has got amazing impact resistance. So engrain means when the tree grows, you cut it horizontally. So all the, the fibers are facing upwards. So when you do kind of hit it, yep. you've got loads of little um, pillars basically that stop the, the board from connecting. whole deck and the rail so underneath this we have um, sandwich material that's called armor cells it's a recycled PET foam so they take plastic bottles that would otherwise be in landfill or in the ocean and then they recycle them into a high density foam so it's the same as what we have, would have in PVC oh okay um, comes out as a green foam um, oh that's the hex the hex yeah. Exactly. Oh, awesome. Fully wraps the whole deck and the rails, um, uh, and it's made of recycled plastic bottles. So. Unreal. Yeah. That is so cool. There's a lot of life in this board, man. Yeah. The blue paint you see here as well, we, we've worked quite hard to get um, this look. So it's actually using water-based dye, um, so the PU paint, so it's like 70% better wow. um, for the environment. And then all the pads here, uh, these are made out of 50% recycled EVA, so we take all the offcuts from the factory and then we grind it back up and then use it. One of the coolest things that I found with testing this is that it actually has better UV resistance. That's amazing. Yeah, and the, the pattern feels really good too for doing nice high performance maneuvers and aerials. And This technology is it's pretty much a story. Every material that we've um, put in this board has been tested and it's passed the test where being better for the environment. This is like we're surfing an eco reincarnation of multiple lives here. I love this thing. <laughs> we're working with Sustainable Surf as you know and um, their highest level is gold level and this board meets those standards. Unreal.
Got you. Love that view looking out of the barrel at Chopo. Woo!